Two teams coming into this game from contrasting fortunes. Kodoko losing to Mediama and Tomin of Boise and City's drawing against Dreams. They want to come back in winning ways. And Kodoko started the game with Fabio Gama, the major threat for the Porcupine Warriors. Sets up Jemfi with this one, who sent a cross in, but Honu got to it first before anybody could pose any threat. Yeah, I'm not sure the cross was good enough. Gama's pass is decent, the run is good, but the cross not good enough. Honu makes a great catch of it, but when you see Kotoko moving into these spaces, then you know you are in trouble because they've got what it takes to hurt you if you afford them these spaces. So from 33 minutes, Gamma delivered and a cheeky flick from Orchids and Okra handing the Porcupine Warriors the lead. So where was the marking? Isaka, Joseph J and the rest of the defensive pack of Legon City. Yeah, it's a harmless boy if you ask me. It's into the near post. Isaka's man is Augustin Okra. Doesn't go tight enough. Doesn't take the responsibility and credit to Okra who makes the run short to the near post and gets a very delicate flick on it. Didn't have to apply enough power. Just the flick was enough. And at the bio, did want to create space for himself. Killed it. And Abalora was equal to the task. Not so much power, not direction. He liked the precision to be the goalkeeper. Yeah, he's, he's been their best player at the bio. On that occasion, just couldn't be the goalkeeper because the curl wasn't enough to go into the top corner. Wonderful cross from Okra. Headed on by Isaka. Not out of total danger. And Chenfi could have made it too. But he missed by inches. Yeah. He just, he just couldn't deal with the, with the area balls there. And Jeffy almost made it, made it count. Fabio Gama found Imoro. Got a shot, but two down. Sampuri whistles. First half over. Kotoko lead Legon City. 1-0 at the break. Goal scored by Augustin Okra. That free kick from Fabio Gama. Excellently flicked off. Second half, underway with Legon City showing enough desire to seek parity with this through pass from Jonah to get to Baba Mahama. But that tracking back from Netted did the trick as Abalora stayed, got a good position to just get the ball without any problems. Jemfi popped up looking for the second for Kotoko, but his target went wide. Esyama was also lurking around looking for that pass. So Kotoko, they managed the game quite well after realizing that Legon City had ideas of equalizing and that pass from Nete to Gama, who tried to set up Nete again, but the first touch was poor. And Honu will claim it. So that's the chance that fell to Baba Mahama. The final ball wasn't good enough. Asam Wajan stepped in and his first attempt was to deliver this free kick that went over the bar. Not one of those free kicks that would trouble Abalora from the former Black Stars captain. So the Porcupine Warriors back on top of the Ghana Premier League. Asante Kotoko came, saw and conquered the Britain Legon Cities by 1-0. Augustin Oakland, the goal scorer. Kotoko go top of the Ghana Premier League with Madiama, the league leader, set to play with Fiodos tomorrow. The Porcupines are back on top of the league log. Can't you see this man or guest in Okra? From that little back flick, from that free kick from Gama, it's ended here in Accra, full time. Legon City's nil. Kotoko won. It's supposed to be 11 against 11. But today we play 11 against, I don't know if it's 14. 15 because it's very very strange what happens during the match a different criteria but as my players and and me myself we need to work so much to make good things i think other people who make part of the game they have to work hardly to learn the rules of the the game because what today the people saw in the home and what we saw in the pitch, it, was, it made me feel ashamed with the football. Football, we, we make mistakes. But it's not possible making mistakes always against the same team. For me, it's very difficult to understand. We didn't lose the match. We won the match. We could score five goals maybe in the first half, in the second. They have one chance to score. But it makes me very sad in this day, coming after the win, talking like this.
congratulations my players congratulations to kotoko fans i think every now i understand why some people told me before the match coach take care about the guy who come to to lead the match i didn't understand now i understood why they told me these things even i'm giving talking with my players and one of the guys come to me and saying i cannot play talk with him i'm not talking with the referees i'm talking with my players you understand because when some players make a hard tackle behind my players i have to tell them take care because another will happen another happens of course i have imoro out is the second time imoro comes out because injury in the game football is not kicking other guys football is respect we try to win second thing very happy to see my asamoa my young boy i brought him 17 years ago to national team he's like me little fat but still a fantastic player and i wish to him all the best i hope kotoko fans commemorate it we are traveling to kumasi thinking what we have to do to have a benefit of a fair referee what we, we should do all right coach then have a safe trip back to kumasi thank and you congratulations thank you coach commiserations it's it's another defeat for your yes. side at Legon City is now not looking good as far as the table is concerned. Yes, Does yes. that bother you now? Is that real sense that maybe yeah, the relegation yeah. is sinking in? Yeah. yeah. But honestly, the, the situation is very, very dicey now. And uh, uh, it needs uh, rejuvenation now. And uh, I think it, is a, it was a tough game. Football is all about mistakes. You, lose, you, you just lose concentration one mistake, they, they punish you. And that was not even, the ball they, they, was not even dangerous. Uh, we thought the judge uh, that they scored and uh, we came in strongly we did all that we came but we couldn't we couldn't we couldn't equalize so that is football for, for Lagos city's fans uh, when you speak to some of them they tell you that if there is one coach in ghana that can keep a side in the premier league then the name is bashi hayford but what do you think has to change now between now and the end of the season oh, well, to keep Lagos cities in the league yeah i think things will change uh, I, can, I can see therapy now, I can see understanding now, I can see that the team is jailing now. Uh, we have about 12 or 30 matches more to play. I think we'll, we'll, still, we'll, still, we'll still be in the, in the league. We are, we, are, we are not despaired at all. We, we, are, we, are for, we never give up. We are going forward. All right, coach. But Kotoko is one of the teams many have said can win the league. Having played against them now, do you think they've got what it takes to go all no, the way? No, it's not only Kotoko. Those up there, because of the point accumulation, any of them. Any of them, they maintain their tempo and momentum. They can, they can, they can take it. But we are gradually coming. No, we cannot do go, do that. Thing, take it the lead, but we want to maintain and then prepare very well all right, for the then. next season. Sorry about today, but all the best next time. Okay, good thank luck. you very much. Captain Emmanuel Jemfi, congratulations today on your performance. You are the man of the match. Sum up the game for us, Jemfi. Uh, first of all, thank you, I could say. And then I'm very happy be, to be today's man of the match of today's game. And then what I could say is glory be to the most high God because I didn't do this alone. I had a support with the help of my colleagues. And then being the man of the match for today's game, I think I'm very happy. All right, so the team played without a recognized striker today, a, a false nine in Okra. How has the team adapted to that system and how much are you enjoying it? Well, we've, we've seen a lot from this coach and then whatever he tells us to do, he only wants a better result for every game. So whoever plays as a fourth nine, you try your best and then to gain that three months more for it. It's nothing new to us because we've been training that our training and then we make good use of it today. But finally, before you, you go, at the start of the season, fans were worried that your form wasn't the best. You scored the last time out against Midiama, and now you are the man of the match. It's your form, finally, coming to the point where the fans used to enjoy. Well, football is like that. Uh, everything is possible, and anything can happen. I, I know I didn't start it well, but, and I think as with a new coach, I'm trying to progress, and then I'm going to improve upon it every match. And I think this has been one of my best, and then I will try as much as possible to do better. All right, let me not keep you here. Go and celebrate with the boys. Congratulations today. Thank you very much.